So when do we need to use mesh in cosmetic breast surgery? So let's first talk about what the mesh is. So the mesh is a supportive scaffold that helps support the weight of the implant. And the purpose of it is to offload your breast skin and breast soft tissues from the weight of the implant. Meaning what we want to do is create a pocket inside where your pec major muscle and this mesh do all the work supporting the weight of the implant. And what's great about that is it offloads the weight of the implant from your skin and soft tissue, which allows you to have implant placement higher up on your chest and to maintain that implant position on your chest over a longer period of time. The people who need mesh in cosmetic breast surgery are generally people who have had multiple cosmetic breast operation revisions and that what the mesh can do is help predictably position the implant in the correct location as well as offload the soft tissues as they're healing to maintain implant position and maintain a nice tight soft tissue envelope around the implants. The other thing the mesh does is it helps control the pec major muscle. So sometimes the pec major muscle will window shade way up on top of the implant after multiple revisions and problems with cosmetic breast surgery. And what the mesh does is it holds that muscle down where it's supposed to be as well as supports the lower pole of the breast implant in place. Another group of people that frequently need biologic mesh in cosmetic breast surgery are people with very thin, stretchy skin. So if you have skin that tends to stretch out really fast, this may help maintain your implant position and breast shape over a longer period of time. And people who've undergone massive weight loss. Weight loss patients oftentimes have very thin skin with lots of stretch marks, and the implants just stretch this skin out really fast and it stays stretched out. It doesn't have any elasticity to spring back. So the biologic mesh can be very helpful in those patients as well. One thing to remember is this biologic mesh in cosmetic breast surgery is more expensive than breast implants, way more expensive than breast implants. This stuff is really expensive. Um, I can get, we can give you prices. If you call, the prices often change, so I don't dare say it in the video, but the cost of the mesh is still less than the cost of more surgery. So think of it that way. If you avoid getting mesh, even though you need it, what you're going to end up doing is paying for one surgery that might not work and then paying for another surgery with the mesh to fix it. So keep that in mind when you're making the decision whether or not to use mesh. I know it's expensive and I know it's easy to say I don't want it because it's expensive but the cost of more surgery is probably more expensive. So keep that in mind. And I will do my best to counsel you based on how important the mesh is in solving your problem. If it's probably not necessary, I will tell you. If it is necessary and you're most likely gonna end up getting another surgery within months if you don't get it, I will tell you. So keep that in mind. So that's basically what the mesh does is it helps maintain the position of the implant helps control the position of the pec major muscle, and it offloads the weight of the implant from the surrounding soft tissue. To learn more, check out our website where you can upload your photos and concerns as a virtual consult. You can also check out our price estimator to get pricing information for all the various procedures we offer. And finally, if you'd like to have your questions answered on a future podcast or Q&A video session like this, please leave a message on our SpeakPipe. You can go to our blog page and our SpeakPipe is located there. Thanks for listening.